grandparents. You've been married yeah. 31 and a half years. Yes, sir. How do you keep the spark there? You know, it's it takes work. Yeah. You you have to explore and have to figure out things that are mm -hmm. going to keep interest in each other. And, and you have to understand that in a marriage that there are going to be times when you question yourself like, you know, what... What are we doing? Why? Why did I? Why am I? Why are we still together? Yeah. But then you have to think a little deeper and think, because we love each other. <laughs> we may just be going through a hard time now, yeah. but it's it's very rewarding to know that I'm sure there are times when she was thinking and I was probably thinking, you know, we ought to call this thing off. Yeah. But you fight through that, yeah. and and yeah. that is so rewarding because you see so many of yeah. of your folks around you that don't yeah. that That's get right. out. And, and I understand that sometimes people aren't meant to live with each other, not yeah. meant to be married, but. But you, you fight through those hard times, and then you get a grandchild, and you think, oh, my gosh, I would yeah. have missed this. That's so right. glad we, we right. stuck it out. Yeah. So glad right. we, we fought the good fight. That's right. That's, that's right. exactly right. And you look at the history you've created, you, you can't replace that. No, that's right.